Yeah, what's up? So this is gonna be my Miss Edward Scissorhands review. All right, so this is Miss Scissorhands. It comes with this dress with attached sleeve and sleevelet, Scissorhands glove, wig, choker, and belt. And this wig is what is pictured right here. And let me show you what this wig really looks like. And like with most costumes, a lot of things aren't as pictured. And you can see the wig was definitely not how they said. And then you can see right here, these cuts were a lot smaller, but you can always rip those, so it's not really a big deal. Um, these look a little different. They're very floppy, and these look like maybe, I think they have separate ones you can buy or something. It's not like the ones that we have, or the ones in here. And then this right here is really cool. These like ripped up thigh highs, and these are easily made, but unfortunately they're not included. So I just wore a pair of regular stockings. And this is made by Secret Wishes, once again, costumes for playful adults. And this is a size small, and they say it fits size two to six. So these are the gloves and the foam scissors that come with it. And you can see these are totally just like very thin foam. So they get really, really floppy, as you can see in the pictures. And it's basically just like a black glove. A regular stretchy glove and then the thing that sucks is that these have little loops that they're stuck on there with and you can see they're glued you can see all kinds of glue on there and the thing that sucks is that mine just fell off so one of them just came off but i was easily able to just stick it back on um you know for the photo shoot i didn't have to use any glue or anything but if you're going out definitely put glue back on to reinforce it if yours falls off also and then this is the middle belt. I say the middle belt because you can see right here it's more like the waist belt or whatever. And it was really big. So it was really big for me. And um, you can see it just got a little strip of Velcro there. So it's not like you can, you know, keep going up if it's too small or too big. So actually I ended up wearing a different belt altogether. And this wig is ridiculous. It's almost like they were going for like a curly look and they weren't sure if they wanted to go straight. So they had a couple curls left over. You can see there's like a couple like frizzy curls. But then the majority of it is straight, so I don't know what was up with that. The dress itself is really nicely made, and it's made out of 100% polyester, it says on the tag. And also you can see that it's an officially licensed product, so that's cool. And it's definitely nice. It's one piece. It's cool. It also comes with, let me grab this uh, little armlet or sleevelet or whatever you call it. And you can see this is actually really nice, and it fits on your arm really good. You can pretty much position it wherever you want. I just put mine lower. Um, you can also put yours up your arm or whatever. But also, I like to wear like a little shrug to go with it so there's no exposed parts because I think it looks better when it's all black. And here's the choker, which is super nice. But once again, I had tape on mine just to make it smaller. It's like everything was gigantic and everything is with Velcro. So you definitely can buy those little Velcro things in like Walmart or craft stores, whatever, that you can stick on if you need to extend it. And the boots I decided to wear with it are these super high stiletto pleaser boots. And these are thigh high. So uh, I definitely recommend pleaser. They're a little expensive, but they're always good and they're stretchy and they're just, I mean, they're terrible to walk in. They, you'll probably kill yourself, but they're good for photo shoots at least. Man, I spin played out, must have missed the news Can't you see I got intelligence? 